A C-section or cesarean section is a surgical procedure we'll do in the operating room where we make a small incision in the lower abdomen and into the uterus and deliver the baby through that incision. It's a procedure we decide to do once the physician and the patient have sat down and decided that's the best course of action for mom and baby so we get the best outcome. We'll do C-sections for a couple different reasons. There's planned and unplanned C-sections. Our planned C-sections are done if we have a patient who has had a previous cesarean section and just decides that she wants to forego labor and have another cesarean section. We'll also do them if the baby's in the wrong position. So in other words, if the baby's breech or bottom down or transverse or laying sideways, we'll have to deliver baby by C-section. We do C-sections also if the placenta or the blood supply to the baby is covering the cervix and that would necessitate us delivering the baby by C-section. Our unplanned C-sections will occur actually during labor. If at any time during labor we're concerned about baby's heartbeat and how well baby's tolerating labor, we'll elect to do a C-section. If we find that mom's in a good labor and just does not continue to dilate her cervix or if she pushes for an adequate amount of time and just will not be able to deliver baby vaginally, then we'll proceed with a C-section. During your C-section, you'll be awake through the whole procedure. We'll make sure that you're very comfortable and numb from about the uterus down, and even though you'll feel some tugging and pulling and some light pressure, you won't feel any discomfort or pain during the procedure. We'll make an incision in the lower abdomen. We'll actually separate the abdominal muscles so we don't have to cut them, and then we'll make an incision in the uterus and deliver the baby through that incision. Once we're done with that, we actually will put the incision back together with dissolvable sutures so those don't even need to be removed. You'll go to a recovery room for a short period of time and then up to your postpartum room where you'll stay for two or three days. The whole time we'll make sure you're good and comfortable with any pain medication you might need and then when you go home you'll have an adequate supply of pain medication there also if you even need to take it. We'll have you back to normal activity within a couple weeks but we'll really make sure even when you get home that you'll be very active and up and around and not have any trouble taking care of your baby. There are risks with any surgery. There's a small risk of complications from anesthesia. There's a small risk that bowel or bladder may be damaged during the procedure. Anytime an incision is made, there's also a small risk of bleeding issues. But remember, these risks are minimal. Our goal is to send you home with a happy, healthy baby. <laughs>